G'day YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I'm here in Ivanhoe in Melbourne today at the Unbun Me uh, shop. It's a bakery, Vietnamese bakery. And surprise, surprise, they have a little bonsai exhibition out the front. Looking absolutely magnificent. I'll just do a little walkthrough and I'll come, I'll come and explain all the trees because some of these are absolute rippers. They've done a great job, the sun's shining and it's looking really magnificent. Well, why don't we start with this beautiful uh, blue cedar. Now, I know the, all the owners of these, they're all Vietnamese and they love their blue cedars. You can have a nice close look at this. Sensational work, really well defined, well refined. Some of them, some of them are really good trees here. Look at the, the pads developed on all these. Looking awesome. And they've got a little, probably a mugao on this or a little black pine, hard to tell exactly. So cool. Now the camera view to a caprosma. And another, look at this trident. Now it's early spring here still, or mid spring, and the leaves are just starting to harden. That's an amazing base on that tree. Have a look at that. This is a Nishki, probably, corky buck. Um, black pine. Nice flaky bark. I'm trying to get into this big tree and another big black pine. Huge base on it. I'll just show you the oh, pretty decent, pretty decent. There's a lovely little trident maple on a rock. Uh, I think this is a prunus of some sort. It looks like a prunus leaf, I'm not sure exactly. But this base, have a look at that. Huge! Big boy, that one. Looks like a little hinoki. Now, this is a good, 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 this is a beautiful black pine. Now, it actually used to belong to me at one stage, and um, a really nice man bought it off me and has really took it to the next level. So, it's really good to see the tree improve over the years. Really nice, really nice buds on there, nice and small. Look at the candles are getting very small as well. Excellent, really fantastic. This is a really cool little black pine. Look at the twisting, twisting trunk on that. The dead wood looks really good too. Now we've got a cedar. As I said, they love their cedars here. This is an Atlantic cedar, I think. Yes, definitely. Or well, sometimes known as Atlas cedar, but not blue. They're just Atlantic cedars. You can see how nicer the pads develop on these cedars and why they're so popular. Oh, this is a little Mugo, I'm pretty confident. really slanting black pine here. I'm trying, hopefully you guys can hear me over the traffic. Pretty crazy. It's on a main road here in Ivanhoe, in Melbourne. This is a very, very tall Shimpaku. Really nice trunk. Well, it's a bit, a bit bright, but I can't really... The, the, the trunk's got that nice light golden brown color, so they've, they've done it nicely. Got a small little shimpaku here. You see the guys all enjoying their bun me at the back. A lot of those club members I know. I'll just get to this black pine now. This is actually quite a popular black pine I've seen quite a few times. It's looking really good. Come along really well. Very decent. Unfortunately, the light's not the best from this angle of these trees. They're a bit dark. I might go around the back just to show you the back of them. A nice little black pine, nice silhouette. Let's 
see if I can turn it around maybe maybe we can see the back of him how's that we'll try and look at the back of him give you an idea maybe this could be the front black pines black pines black pine definitely for the back of that one this is a little cedar again this is a lovely cedar group but this is the back of it I'll show you the front of it in a minute and a black pine Uh, too dark but that's all right you get the idea I'll have a little display outside now there's actually an even better display inside well the minis so it looks this is more the bigger trees out here which come up really nicely but I'll do how to show you the minis in a minute this is their little ad they've put up and here's a couple of little trees in the window hopefully you won't see my reflection or well, probably can't see it because the reflection oh it doesn't matter try and get them a little wisteria this little shimpak is pretty amazing I'll try and put a shadow in it so you, can, you guys can see um, here's my favorite favorite section of the show it's inside and it's on a stand with good lighting it's absolutely come up amazing now the great thing is I'm seeing my old trees here this used to belong to me at one stage coming along really well but this is absolutely a perla right now. It used to be mine, but he's done such a great job on, on this tree. It's almost a blue, light, like a bluish foliage on it. Look at that foliage. He's done a great job wiring it up and looking after it. This olive also was at one, in my collection at one stage, looking really nice. This is a lovely little tree with a dinosaur on it. <laughs> Very cool. And this is a gorgeous little shimpaku. Also, one stage was mine. It's got beautiful, beautiful trunk movement. I love the foliage. Here's a bit more. Another little guy that was on mine, my list. Looking so good. It's always good to see trees getting better with that with time. Little siju elm. A little black pine. And a little hanoki. looks fantastic we've got some nice seedrew elm in this corner a little ooh, could be a black and they've got a little raffle going how good is that just having a closer look at this little mugo tiniest tiniest little buds on that Beautiful. Just a closer view on this very large black pine. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this quick little short video on a little display at the Unbun Me in Ivanhoe, Melbourne. Nice to see trees in the sunshine outside looking pretty awesome. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Take care.